Okay, I'm doing Dave's Atmos's tag about welfare recipients. And I wanted to do this, oh, I wanted to do this a couple of days ago, and um, I just, I did not have the energy to even get dressed. Well, I mean, like, I sat in the same thing for maybe a couple of days. And that's alright. Because I was clean. I was clean. I don't stinky. So, I just didn't really give a crap. And I basically laid around pajamas for the week. But I'm actually going out for lunch today. So, yeah. And this is the, the welfare tag, which I've been wanting to do. And, um, I love you, Dave. Man, you're right here. You're right here. <laughs> okay. Do you think all welfare people are bums? Well, you belly bum? No, I don't. I don't think so at all. I think that we are quite um, an interesting group. And I'm, I'm going to lump dis disability into welfare because it's all the same. For the most part. Um, we, we tend to you know, fit in that category that people hate us because we have no lives and we can't do anything. Alright, next. Um, and we do have lives. I'll get to that. Do you think that they all drive new cars and have all the good stuff? I don't have a car and all my good stuff, except for my smartphone, actually has been um, gifts. My computer was a gift from my parents a couple years ago for Christmas. My television, um, my iPod, those are gifts that I got. So, and those are really about the only nice things I have. And I am a very uh, thrifty person. I love thrift stores. Um, I think you can find some of the most beautiful gems at thrift stores and sale racks. So, I don't think that we are bums because we don't have, you know, the everything, the elite thing. I don't lay on the street. I have an apartment. You know, it's not the best, but I'm not on the street. Uh, do you think they all... Okay, that's what we got. Never mind. Uh, three. Do you think there is no reason people should not be working? You know, being disabled is an obvious reason. Although, I do... I even get crap for this. Um, you know, you could at least have a job. Um, no. Not really, because if I had a job, I'm not dependable enough to go to it. People that remember me uh, working, because I used to work full time. I used to enjoy working. Um, I worked since I was 17 till I was, oh my heavens, 27, I think. And it was um, 28, I'm sorry. And it was just... Yeah, it was wonderful, but um, with my disability, because it is a degenerative thing, uh, it became harder and harder and harder to be able to show up <laughs> at work, let alone do my job. Um, and I got hurt, and um, I broke my back in three different spots in my vertebrae, but I'm not paralyzed, um, but I do live in pain, and I... From that point on, I had a couple little jobs, like seasonal, um, part-time-ish type things, and I barely got through the last one. So it was, it, it's just pointless. And so, no, I don't think that it's a matter of should not, it's a matter of can you. Number three, do you think there is, no, whoops, sorry. Number four, do you think that people on the dole need to be rounded up and put into work camps. No, but we'll probably end up in a FEMA camp, so whatever, okay? I want to see me and Dave, like, on the chain gang, okay? Yeah. All right. Um, do you think that all welfare people are on drugs or drunks? No. As a matter of fact, 90% of the people that I know um, are not drunk or on drugs that are on it. Um, there are perhaps people that were at one point 
and those are usually the functioning alcoholics that did work um, and then something happened and they could no longer work or, or something but um, you gotta remember guys addiction is a disease okay I do believe that with all my heart because I don't believe that anyone could ask for something such as an addiction because um, and people think that cigarettes are just some peste. Oh, you can get over it. You can get over it. Because it's, you know, legal. But is, is it really any different from being on heroin? Other than the fact that um, we're not like, uh, you know, whatever. Um, breaking the nicotine habit is the worst thing that I have ever dealt with. I quit drinking with no problem. I can take it or leave it now, which is nice. Um, and I actually won't leave it. Um, I was addicted to some over-counter fun stuff, um, like, uh, legal speed, um, for a while, and, um, I got off of it like that. I mean, it was no problem. The cigarettes, I could have killed somebody's grandma for one. So, it is a disease. It is not fun. Nobody asked for it. So, I really hate these people. They're like, you know, they're just on drugs. You know, it's like you don't get it. So, it doesn't mean you have to deal with it, but it is a disease. Okay. Um, and the only thing you can do is pray. Um, do you think that welfare people are all stupid? No. Not at all. Um, I'm not stupid, am I? Well, okay, don't answer that. Um, no, intelligence-wise, um, no, I don't. Not at all. I know people who've never worked a day in their life and are brilliant people, but their physical limitations is what keeps them from having a job. Most creative, brilliant people I know, actually. Imagine that. Uh, maybe they aren't quite as tainted. Seven. Do you think that all welfare people are criminals? No, I honestly, I don't know anybody who's been in prison that um, is on welfare at this time. And there were quite a few people. If they have been to prison, it was not for very long, I'm sure, um, because I just can't foresee anybody I know being in prison. Um, have you been to prison, Dave? No, I know who's been to prison. Stevie. I'm just kidding. Um, I love pecking on him because it's just so, okay. Okay, um, if you answered yes to any of these questions, do you know how misinformed you are? Wow, I don't think I did. No. I did not. I have been informed. And last, oh, it says, it says, if not, thank God you have the ability to reason. Yes, I do. And I think the people that go around thinking that are either A, jealous, because they are everything on here. They are everything on here. They are lazy. They are drunks. They are bums. They are just like the most angry people with no compassion, no soul that I have ever met. And they need to change their ways here real quick because there are people that have a ton of reasons besides just being lazy, drunk, and bums. Right? So anyways, there we go. That's it. And I think I have another tag somewhere. I saw one. It was Stevie's birthday tags, but I have to go find it. And I'll probably do that after I get back from lunch. Which, you know what? I may just have a drink so I can take my drunk, disabled ass home. <laughs> I love you guys. Peace be with you. Bye-bye.